Well, this is our Facts of Mars, and I'm addressing Michael Savage, the talk show host, directly. Uh, very concerned with the spider bite you got. I did a little research, and as I expected, it's probably a recluse spider. There are only two dangerous spiders, varying some, uh on the North American continent. One is Black Widow, and like I said, variants of that. And the other is the Reckless Spider. Now, the Widow has a potent neurotoxin. And it'll put you in the hospital, but there is an antivenom, and it is treatable. You can only have antivenom once in your life for some reason. I don't know what the reason is. But your symptoms do not sound consistent with that. You'll have severe muscle spasms and shakes, difficulty breathing and so forth. All the symptoms are consistent with neurotoxin. Your symptoms, from what I've heard on your radio show, are more consistent with that of a recluse spider, specifically the desert res recluse spider, which is one that is available there in uh, Northern California. Recluse spiders in Northern California. The desert recluse is the commonest type of recluse to be found in California. This species inhabits the eastern desert regions of the state. Bites from these spiders are rare as they are usually not found in high population areas, so encounters with humans are limited. There are also Chilean recluses in the Los Angeles area. They are considered one of the most toxic species of the recluse family. Ah. Uh, the recluse spider has a progressive necrotizing uh, poison that will basically eat you alive. And it just keeps getting worse and worse and worse. Here are the symptoms, blistering, severe pain, chills, fever, nausea, necrosis at the site of the bite, lesions. Unfortunately, there's no effective antivenom for recluse bites, but medical care should be found as swiftly as possible. It should also be known that most recluse bites are unremarkable. Now, I'm hoping that you didn't get a uh, really bad dose from this, but uh, you really need to Get on your doctors about it because it does not look like a widow bite, which means it was a recluse bite. And if it's a recluse bite, you're in trouble. Because the recluse is more dangerous than the widow ever was. Best advice for somebody who, uh, if you get bit by a spider, Try to capture it, if you can, without getting bit a second time. Put it in a glass jar and get it to an entomologist so you know you can find out what it is. Don't smash it to a pulp. Try to capture it in a glass jar and get it to an entomologist. I'm very concerned, Dr. Savage. I'm very worried about you. This could be very, very bad. Get on your doctors and tell them you think maybe you were bitten by a recluse spider of some kind. Bad news. Probably not a black widow. And there are other venomous spiders on this continent, of course. Uh, 
such as non-silk producing spiders like the uh, tarantula. But the tarantulas are not considered dangerous to humans. That's my advice. You're going to have to stay on this because this could be very, very bad for you. And I'll show you his uh, page. There's the uh, finger that got bitten. Bad news, Dr. Savage. If it is a recluse bite, there's no known treatment. But they can at least do something, I would assume. No other facts of Mars. Thanks for watching. Please, Dr. Savage, stay on this. It could be life-threatening. Thanks for watching.